Our health alert tonight. We are just hours away from 2019 and millions of Americans are already making their New Year's resolutions. And one of the most popular resolutions, of course, involves health. Mm. Our chief health editor, Dr. Parthenandi, he's here to tell us some ways we can improve our well-being. In 2019, we are all looking for things to do to start the year right. Side Anne Marie, the new year actually presents a great opportunity to have a happier and healthier lifestyle. And the American Medical Association has released a list of resolutions that'll have a long-lasting impact on your health. So for our Channel 7 viewers, here are seven doctor-recommended resolutions. First, find out if you're at risk for type 2 diabetes. This is one of the most important and chronic health conditions affecting more than 30 million Americans. But the CDC estimates a quarter of these cases are undiagnosed. Next is get up and move. Please get off the couch, right? Adults should get 150 minutes of moderate aerobic activity each week, and you don't have to go to the gym. Some everyday activity actually towards this goal counts uh, such as walking, cleaning, taking the stairs, and what I'll be doing tonight, which is dancing. And number three, don't eat a lot of processed foods that are loaded with sugar, salt, fat, and chemicals. Cook more of your meals at home using fresh vegetables, fruits, and whole grains. Another trip, please drink water instead of sugar-sweetened drinks. Next, know your blood pressure number. Hypertension is a leading cause of stroke and heart disease, but you can manage your blood pressure with proper diet and exercise. Now, a few more healthy habits for the new year. Please drink alcohol in moderation and stop smoking, please. And kick stress to the curb, finally, with exercise, meditation, or yoga. All right, doctor. So one of the hardest things to do and to stick to is, of course, our resolutions. Any tips on how we can maybe stay the course? You're absolutely right, Alan. And, but you have to remember that you're not going to get healthier overnight. It takes time and patience. So set smaller achievable goals, really important. For example, work, work your way up to increased physical activity and get a good workout buddy so you can keep each other on track for a healthier, happier 2019. And happy New Year to everybody out there. Some good tips for sure. All this right. year, I'm going to try and stick to my resolution longer than a month. Diet starts tomorrow, though, yeah. right? <laughs> Happy New Year, Dr. Danny. Thanks for those great tips. And if you have any questions or health concerns for the doctor, you can email him, Dr. Nandy, at askdrnandy.com, or you can send it to us on Facebook or Twitter. And